What's up everyone, I'm Jesse, and I'm here in the Harley Davidson Museum to share the story of the buyback of 1981. After the 1969 merger with AMF, production modernized with the opening of the York factory, but tensions remained through the financial recession of the mid-1970s. In 1980, AMF decided to put the motor company out for sale and an opportunity presented itself. In June 1981, a group of 13 Harley-Davidson executives, including Willie G, made the risky move to pull their funds together and buy the company back. To celebrate, they went on a commemorative ride to announce that the Eagle soars alone. There were tough years ahead to be sure, but this group of 13 joined with dealers and employees to help keep Harley-Davidson alive for generations to come. That's it for today's trip through history. Come back again as we celebrate 120 years of Harley-Davidson.